Deep breath out. Okay. So, everything's paused. We don't have to worry about the restaurant as it's moving. We can just leave, get a nice view of Rome. Actually, what's in L.A.? What's the big landmark over here? Oh, it's the Hollywood sign. Hey, isn't that like a... Yeah, let's let's get uh, make sure that content ID hits me here because I think the Hollywood sign is very much a uh, some kind of weird copyright crap about that. I don't know. Aha! Eat it. It's not the actual Hollywood sign. It's a close enough representation. Okay, so while we stare at the Hollywood sign, I'm going to go through all these recipes and make sure everything is. Cause look at the seafood quiche. We got like the crab from the food fruit factory. I don't know. Maybe they're fruity crabs. Look at this. Seafood quiche. Wait, holy shit. This seafood quiche just went from, like, a pretty good dessert to a god-tier dessert. It's now up to 78. Holy shit. If the, sea the seafood quiche needs to go everywhere it can possibly go. Okay. Starting from the beginning. Breakfasts. Ooh. Orange? Okay. Put some orange in the scones. That's fine. Alright. Artichoke crepes with langanosts. That's alright. Looking good. Lemon, from the, not the fruit factory, okay. Spaghetti with artichokes, not bad. I really do need to look at that menu again. Alright, I think I've gone through all of those. Cream of asparagus, can get a little bit of a lemon. 0.13 of a lemon, I think that's what the EA means. It's each lemon, so 0.13 of a lemon. It It's award winning and terrible, no one ever wants it. I wouldn't even want it. We got so many better soups. Fisherman's soup, and we got some clam for the New England clam chowder, and look at that fucking clam. Yep, that's that's getting up there, but it's making it, making some splashes here. Ooh, look at that. Looking good there, too. Pea soup, okay. Time for the main dishes. Saw that down there. Get some orange on the beef dabbing. 71 ain't too bad. Not doing too much. What's the artichoke chicken? Do we not have, like, chicken chicken? What's the chicken recipe we have that was upgraded to? Chicken breast. We have good chicken breast. We do not have chicken, though. Which, okay, sure. Wh why not? We only get the good breasts? That's weird. Okay, we'll I'll just keep going here. Odd that the person supplying us the chicken breasts can't give us the rest of the chickens at the same quality, but who knows. Lemon seems to be pretty important on the lemon and herb fish, but it didn't improve the rating any, so... Eh, what do you do? Lemon on that might bring it into the... Nope, it's still pretty crap. Lemon on the rosemary will... Ooh, 55, not bad. The pizzas are still kind of sucking. Not much I can do there. The spaghetti gets some nice clams. Starts to come back. Ooh, we finally have muscle. Okay, well, four star muscle. So we got. Let's make some predictions here. It's one and a half stars. I'm looking at like, th not three stars, but like two and a half. I want to say forty-five. I think this is gonna give it like a twelve to fifteen point raise because it's muscles. It's the only thing in the freaking ingredients here. A little bit of olive oil might help, but the salt and the water, or they're salt and water. All right. And 42. Under my expectations. At least it's a two-star, but it can't do much better than that, really. All right. Stuffed peppers. Got some lemon to put on the tuna steak, and that didn't help it. Um, yeah. We just went through that again. Okay, the seafood quiche just became god-tier. Got some lemon for the Strawberries Jubilee. Hey, it's up in the 50s now. Good for you. Ooh, passion fruit. We almost have everything. Everything is almost going for this, but it's just not quite there. And I don't think it's going to eclipse too much more. Orange on the chocolate tart. I'm not going to ask questions. Food is just food, and it does weird things like that. French apple tart is now up to 51, interestingly enough. All right, I'm going to click these. Just so... Oh, you can't reduce the quality anymore. I can reduce the quality on the nutmeg. That's still a 50, though, for 94 cents. Oh, well. Passion fruit. Yeah, well, that was actually pretty incremental there. That went to 47, not bad. 
50 peaches and seafood. All right. I think we've done that. I, I'm going to really look into La Cosa Nostra here because I very much think that we could add a couple things. Uh, the cappuccino is pretty good. Strawberries Jubilee. Meringue with forced fruits. See, there's just better things here. Okay, I'm taking off the strawberries and the meringue. <laughs> Cappuccino Sunday is right up there. Okay. 59 looks good. 55 is a maybe. Yeah, we'll, we'll go with it. Take two off, put two on. Uh, right, and then turn the pages, actually get to the desserts. This is $3. It's already cheap as shit, too. Yeah, I mean, keep them that way, that's cool. Nick's casserole of pork is doing just nicely. I'm sure people are getting a lovely amount of that. Alright, so we increased that. These are still award winners, but... 71's already on the menu, 80's already on the menu, 69 might, we might just have to replace them. Yeah, I think we gotta replace them, and we need to go get them an award. I'm probably gonna enter that into the LA food contest, so spaghetti with artichokes is on, and the, man, the award winners are off, that's sad, but, eh, gotta make way for the new. Alright, spaghetti with artichokes, nice $9 recipe. And we've already got uh, enough award winners here. We can we can afford to get rid of one. All right, that should bring some very good upgrades there, and hopefully that food goes up because we can't really do much else about anything else. Ninety one, come on! When does it turn over to five stars? It's it's getting up there. I'm halfway tempted to throw a hundred thousand bucks at these guys just to train them and whatever else they're missing, but they got this. Pretty much down pat. Yeah, they've already got 100% on the new stuff. They know what's up. Alright. Speaking of which, I might be able to do something interesting with this over here. Actually, the seafood quiche is already on there. Eh, we're, we're not doing too bad, actually. Nah, let's we'll keep it as it is. We're dumping money into this place, too. Um, and now, I did mention that I wanted to go to the cooking contest, and we have Armand here. Uh, we don't necessarily have to bring window dressing, he's over here. Um, is the Pelor Chantant, this is back in Rome, but that's not what I'm talking, the Alouette. Is, does this have our golden boy? It does have our golden boy. Hmm. Alright, let's, let's go... Let's go to the International Chef Arena. Oh, the International one is in L.A., but in Rome and France, it's only the regionals, I see. I don't have the $10,000. <laughs> Man, I'm terrible with money. Okay. Well, this is... Okay, I can actually like go to the loan officer and say, All right, hear me out. I've already taken out so much money, but this time... I'm going to a cooking contest that I intend to win. And they don't care. I'm not at my credit limit yet. Okay. But I do actually need to win this. So uh, let's get going on that. Okay. And all of my chefs are here. And all of them are in proud working order. Okay. So for the French, we've got Armand. Or sorry. Uh, Shia LaBeouf. All right, we're bringing the golden boy over here for the Italian, uh, Mario Corleone. And we only have two chefs. Oh, that's all we need. <laughs> yeah, apparently me and my intern are, or not me, uh, Shia LaBeouf and the intern are just going to the top together. And Baldi's come back. All right, French recipe. What hasn't won yet and what can, what can do us the best? Uh, let's see. This is pretty good. 99% there on... Oh yeah, this hasn't won anything, has it yet? And we have the Super D Duper didn't actually do too much. 
this hasn't won anything yet, so with a nice 75 rating, I think we can make a big splash in the first round here. Let's go. Oh yeah, 76 already. 77, baby. That probably missed. Yep, alright. Seventy-seven ain't bad. All right, how? What are other people doing? Sixty-four. You lost already. Done. Sixty-seven. It's already mine. First round, calling it. I'm pointing for the stands as a home run already. Calling the shot. Unfortunately, gotta wait for the oven to actually cook the thing. Don't you dare burn it, Shia LaBeouf. He's got this. He is 99% sure of his abilities. And nothing is stopping him. Sixty-one? Wait a minute, they actually went below the belt there. Hold up. I thought they were gonna do better. I saw a 67 somewhere. What happened? Someone fucked up. Someone burnt something. I think I paid off a judge. Alright, Italian. Switching up here. Gotta get the right guy here. Alright, what's a good Italian recipe that we're going for? That's already won an award. That ain't too bad. It's gonna be under hitting, though. Macaroni and meat sauce. I think won an award already. That won an award, definitely. The spaghetti with artichokes hasn't, though. Yeah, we're doing it. 74. Go. That was actually kind of slow. That was pretty easy. Oh shit, I'm only getting these targets. Give me a sorting, thank you. 60. Okay, 77, not bad, not bad. I didn't even check the competition, but... <laughs> Keep them sevens coming. Okay, they're they're tied for, you know, second place. No contest. Alright, now comes the American recipe. And we gotta look through what's good here. So <laughs> we can just cook this again. Fuck you guys. Nah, nah, nah. Alright. Hmm, that's not too bad actually. Creamy potato soup is about as good as we're gonna get on that. Although we could send in the Wonder Boy, and that's not gonna do much. Creamy pumpkin, New England clam chowder. That'd be an interesting thing to put into one of these. Ooh, he's not so good on these. Might be leaning on him a little too hard. Although, we've got our desserts that we can lean on. Ooh, wow. I'm surprised that the mango fans are that good. Ooh. Oh, man, hold on. It didn't help. Uh, the seafood quiche has not won an award yet. I gotta keep that in my back pocket, though. That's gotta be like the god tier thing I send out when Omni Food starts challenging me. Like, aha, but I have my trap card, the seafood quiche. I'm, I'm keeping it in. I'm keeping it in reserve. Um, let's go with the. I bet I could win with the mango fans, honestly. Ah, uh, decisions, decisions. This is basically the throwaway. If the scores are anything, I can lose by at least 30 and still be on top. Well, uh, let's keep sorting through this. Hold on, does the Wunderkind have anything better here? Not really. In fact, he's actually a little bit worse. Yep, Armand's gonna have to take us with the American stuff. Um... I still want to make an impressive showing, but, like, a good chicken marinade and garlic wouldn't be too bad. What we got here? Parsley and almonds? Mm, bumped it up a point. Crunchy chicken cutlets. If he was better at cooking it, I would totally go for it. The Fish Wellington's already won an award, so we don't need to do that. The veal chop. Can't really get any better. Lemon and herb fish. Use the secret ingredients and not really get much. 64, starting to get better. Roasted leg of rosemary lamb, put our secret lemon on it, get nothing better. I could see this working out. 
I'm gonna do that unless I get a better idea. That's a maybe. No, nah, that's that's a guarantee. That's that's good. In fact, that's a that's everything. I can use that if I come up short anywhere less. No, nah, let's 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 do it with the uh, rosemary lamb and the ingredients. Eh, it wouldn't be too bad with him either. But now nah, we got to go with the uh, Shia here. Do it. That sucked. Eye on the prize. Not the prize. Second place. Eh, got up to 66. Not too bad. Coming up short in the third round, but uh, who cares? Actually, what kind of recipe is this? Can I check? Switch it halfway through. Nah, it's still half French. Kind of cheating. Leaning on those French skills with technically American recipes. Hey, got those dubs. Check them. Ah, that was bad. <laughs> I feel bad for saying that, and I apologize profusely. But I got some chicken with tarragon vinegar. That ain't bad. And 40k. Holy shit, really already? Hey, Armand's not doing too bad. If I actually go to the information center, there should be a Star Chefs. Oh, look at that. Third place. Winning. Got to kill Joe Stone and Bernard Compton. They've got some pretty gray hair there, so I think they'll be... Oh, he's only 60. I can't do the uh, Europa Universalis thing and hope that they die because they've got like a 25% chance every year. But screw you, Tom Poole. I'm owning this shit. Stan is also in sixth. I don't know why. Tyrone Simpson. Uh, what's Mr. T's name? I can't remember. You know, we got some top chefs, though. Also, uh, where's our intern? He, he should be up there. Bob Baker. That That's a beard. That is a legendary beard. I think he got 12th place. Oh, wow. Yeah, he's, he's up in 10th. Riding on the coattails and occasionally doing the uh, Italian dish that needs to be done. Okay, good. I actually won some money off of that. Uh, can we not do... We can do another one. Alright, let's keep getting money. One chef, three rounds. Ooh. Ooh. -hoo -hoo. Ooh. Okay, here's... I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this one. But I'm gonna break out the devil food cakes for the Italian portion. And Shia LaBeouf is taking gold. We got this. We got this. I might have to bring back an old recipe, but we got this. And Baldy here. Is he like Omni Food? He is Peter Flint. He's going in with the grapefruit gratin with roasted almonds. Over here is Leonardo Varesi with... Oh, I see. Someone's trying to cook me a recipe that I already know. Alright. <laughs> we got 80% over here. I uh, got 72 on the brand new recipe. That's interesting. I don't want to be behind when things happen, though. We could... Oh, man. We could totally just enter the dried bean casserole and eat. Just ha just wipe the floor with people. Okay. If I can beat a 76, then I'm probably going to go... 84? Are you kidding me? And this has won an award, but still, 84. I could just, you know, say goodbye to them in the first round and make sure they don't come anywhere close. I could put the steamed muscles on. No, I'm surprised. Hold on, what's what's up with your French skills here? Um nah, I guess I guess he's better at the appetizers. I I'm keeping you in reserve. You're good. Ugh, that's sad that okay, hold on, we got we got some extra stuff here. Bump that up to wait a fifty? Hold on, what was it before? I made it worse by adding my secret ingredients? That's messed up. <laughs> Wait a minute, isn't he doing the fruit gratin with almonds too? Grapefruit gratin. Interesting. Oh shit. I did not mean to click that. Fuck it, I'm beating him at his own game. Oh, I did not make that a proper decision. But I still got a 72. I hope I'm not penalized for taking 
another recipe that someone else is cooking. But I'm going down. I'm taking him with me. <laughs> I'm doing a fruit gratin. He's doing a grapefruit gratin. It's different. 73, right? Oof. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Slam on the table. Are you kidding me? You got me by one point. This guy's supposed to be some master of French culinary arts. Alright, nope. I'm not holding back anymore. Whatever I can do that is just the best, I'm doing it. I don't care if it's one before. 72. It's currently the winner. 76. I might. I might. 76. Gonna have to pull out the stops here. 77 on the guilt-free cappuccino sundae. 72 on the peaches. He still got me by point, though. This is... Yeah, no. What's 77 was the biggest thing I had? 72, 76. Where's that 77? I don't care what it is, we're doing it. Okay. This is disheartening already. Go. Nope. Seventy nine. Beat that asshole. Once again I am cracking my knuckles, but that's just that's an intimidation tactic. Okay, back on top. Ooh, we're getting chased though. We're getting chased. They aren't they aren't letting up and we we still got a dessert we still got a round here for an American recipe. Alright. Gotta give it top quality. 72. 70. 77. That'd be funny if I did that again. 72. 80. Oof. No. Keep, I gotta. I have to keep that, but I gotta gotta hold back. I know the 85 is up there, but I gotta hold back. I think I can I think I can win this with the peaches. I've got this with the peaches. Send the peaches in, man. It's close though, it's close. It's still it's still only a 60% recipe. We've been making, we made some ground in the Italian round. We used an old classic, but oof, it's gonna be close. It's gonna be close. I can't break out the seafood quiche yet. That's our, it's our fucking kamehameha there. That's our last round. That's our, it's the move we use to finish them off. Can we beat the seafood quiche though? I'm going I'm going with the peaches. 72, right? Yeah, I can't I can't drop an 85 in this competition. This is already won. We could cook it. It's a 75. 76 ain't too bad either. 63. 72 on the fish wellington. If the fish wellington can pull through with a 72, I think we can do this with the desserts. Just go for it. We got this. Got it. Damn it. Still doing it. Killing it. 75. Alright. I don't think they can keep up. Let's see what they're doing. 71. Lost. Done. New England clam chowder. 72. They both did the chowder. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that's just terrible. They both they both cramped themselves with the chowder. Yeah, that's a 71. They made the mistake I made in round one. He's got a little bit better on top of that, but I think we got I think we pinched this. Oh yeah. Ooh, he got a 75 in the end, but nope, we came out on top. Or should I say Shia LaBeouf came out on top? First place. Got a whole fucking trophy too, and snow pea salad. Whew, he's so, he's only second from that win though. And yep, we're out of competitions. Ooh, that was exciting. All right. All right, so a bunch of new recipes. Wait a minute, we haven't won with this yet. Why didn't I throw that out there? Oh, it's an Italian recipe. Ah, and I was cramping myself by putting out the. Uh, 
guilt-free cappuccinos again. Oh no, and I didn't even do the devils either. Ah, desperate times, desperate measures, I had to. But I do have another thing in my back pocket if the Italian recipe... So I just need like a bang-on French recipe or something if the seafood quiche is... Yeah, this is American and French, and I can't... I don't think I can do it twice. I think I can, but I don't know if I'll get away with it. So that's pretty good. We got one of those. We got our Italian, so... Something else comes up. We, we got this. OmniFood wants to challenge us. We will bring our best, and it will be completely unknown. I'm not selling any goddamn recipes either. Oh, yeah, we also have a huge-ass loan. Should we start repaying this? The interest isn't that bad. Although our credit limit's going down. Okay. I owe at least 40000 of the prize money because we borrowed money to even get into this, but I think we're good. Yep, credit limit's going back up. And it's changing? Is so Really? Okay, someone's sitting at their desk going, Nah, we could probably loan them 20 more dollars. Well, if we recalculate the... It, I know it's a computer doing it, but it doesn't really have a precedence. Okay, so with that, I'm going to build something on the wagon, so just a little something. Or a complete ground floor overhaul, because that's, you know, one star. There we go, attractive gas-powered lamps. Can't get over those. Uh, yes, please add those on. There we go. Just gotta add that little touch. Little flavor. Uh, what? Any complaints here yet? Noise complaints, and people don't like their shit. Well, that's gonna happen. Ooh, man, I need to watch this place during rush time one of these days. Plenty's getting cooked over here, although our, uh, a new chef isn't doing too well, but we'll teach her the ropes. We'll spend 100k on her. Probably 50k. I think it's 50k per restaurant is the maximum. Cooking up a storm, though. What? What's this queue that people are so afraid of in other restaurants? We have four chefs and a full-ass kitchen to do everything in. I just gotta make sure this is actually on four stars and keep it there. And we need to make some more money, too. It's nice to have money. Uh, let's see. Speaking of money and other things. Ooh. Oh, yeah, okay. No, it's just the exterior and the view. We'll, we'll, we'll work on that. That's If that's the only thing keeping this at three stars, then excellent. Alright, that being said, goals, got that monthly profit of, yeah. Oh, good, if it's a profit thing, then we can, how much do we have? Our deadline is six months? Yes, six months, okay, good. Alright, so the good news is we can tank our profits and make sure we actually make money in other restaurants, and okay, good. I like to see that we've got a good stopping point in the scenario where we, for two or three months we can make sure that people are trained up and doing well. Okay, actually, I do want to take a look at Dahlia's skills because she's only got the little bit of Delia. Delia? Dahlia? Oh, well, some kind of a name. Okay, she's got minor French skills, and they really don't even, they just start to get into the cake on the dessert, and I think the rest are the same. So we'll see where the points go when we spend money on Wagon Toe. And they're all just washing dishes, apparently. Wait a minute, are they all supposed to be washing dishes? Auto, wash dishes, auto. Oh, now could you please just operate the dumb waiter? I don't think we need it this late, but... Just making sure. Okay. Nice, easy cleanup. Hopefully a profitable month so I've got enough money to splash around. Let me double check where the training is going to. Yep. 
That's fine. The Palorda Chantant's got everyone in there. I did move the guy from Trezatavla to the other place. Ooh, Trezatavla's got four and a half. I don't know where it came from. Okay, exterior in view definitely needs the upgrade now, but we can't really do all that much. Ah, I lost it. We'll get it back. Ah, see, we did. Right there. Immediately. Um, yeah, those two are just fine, so perfect. We've got everything we need to being funneled into our teaching kitchen. Right? Oops, I missed. I think so. Let me check Cosa Nostra, because I think those two are just set them and forget them. They're doing all right. He's found his niche. The Gentile might have... Mario's currently propping this place up, but hopefully one day we'll have this working on its own and we can keep people going forward if need be. Um, but it looks like we're doing all right there. Yep. And here comes the end of the month. Putting all that away, making sure the... Yep, all right, just gotta wait for it then. Okay, good. Not profiting where we don't want to profit. Profiting everywhere else. N nicely so, especially with the extra money from the competitions. Perfect. Average satisfaction is up, and great. We can just keep on this for a while and do just fine. No problems about it. 